हेलो आर बड़ी दिस इज योर बैक एंड बड़ी प्रतीक मोहता सो टुडे वी विल लर्न अबाउट चैट जीपीटी सो वी विल ट्राई टू लर्न गो प्रोग्रामिंग लैंग्वेज कंसेप्ट यूजिंग द चैट जीपीटी एंड विल सी हाउ इट इज रिस्पॉन्डिंग सो बेसिकली चैट जीपीटी इज अ चैट बॉट विच इज यूजिंग आर्टिफिशियल इंटेलिजेंट सो इफ एनी वन आस्क क्वेश्चन देन इट विल बेस्ड ऑन द ए आई इट विल कलेक्ट आंसर एंड रिप्रेजेंट अस so to use chat gpt first you will require to do sign up uh, from this open ai website so i have already done the sign up so if you will click here it will ask you uh, email registration or registration using the social login after sign up process you will able to see this type of interface so here chat.openai.com uh, will be there and here chat gpt will be there so you can type your any question here and uh, based on artificial intelligence it will respond you the answer so for learning golang so let's learn about uh, for loop or in the golang okay so i will uh, write for loop in golang and if i press enter then uh, you will see here like uh, it will give us all the detail of the for loop so here for and then initialization will be there conditioning so this if you see this is typing automatically all the uh, details of that so what is the initialization then condition will be there and everything now it's giving a uh, example so basically in the golang we can write this way for loop also like for i equal to 1 and then i less than equal to 10 and i plus plus and then we can print it okay so yeah uh, so this is the basic example of for loop it it given now if if we want to see like a slice of uh, for loop then we will write for loop of slice in golang and enter for loop of so for loop of slice in the golang so see here uh, it's created a slice of integer if you see here you can copy code also and then here integer value uh, it's index and the value is there and it is just printing its uh, index and value so this is the simple way uh, it's explaining how we can create the slice of a for loop uh, so here for index then its value then range and then we have to add the slice okay so it will print the integer slice okay now uh, let's say uh, we want to see rest api so how to create rest api in golang and if i press enter then it will fetch so rest api so it is using the net http package if you see here so here it will give the example of the uh, net http package and uh, so if you see it use the that package also and http dot handle func and slash and he has written the function response writer and request and hello world so this will be a basic rest api which will print as a like hello world things and it it's listening on the 8080 if you want to create a user api then slash user and it's writing here like so you can add multiple like if it is a get post put delete all that things so it's giving us all the details uh, even in the writing it is giving and with the example also it's giving so you can copy code at any time so you can use third party library like gorilla mux also so net http is a basic row method but this gorilla mux is a uh, for the http routing uh, third party library is there which is uh, more popular for you uh, creating the rest api so if you see it is giving all the details uh, so if you want to learn or if you have any questions then uh, you get all the details like what is differ in golang and if i press enter so 
defer is used like uh, when we uh, at the end of all the things processing we want to close something so uh, let's say file closing or anything so it's it will give the example so so if you see that defer function call will not execute immediately so instead it will execute uh, like once the that differ statement uh, okay so it, this is giving example if you see here uh, so like you have opened the file and then you have enter that file or close so these things will be executed once all the this processings are completed okay so if you see like call will be executed just before main function returns and if you do the differ function one two three then in this case function 3 will be executed first whatever at the end then 2 and then 1 so this was the concept of the differ so kind of that way you can learn any things uh, you can ask so it is not still accurate but it is a artificial intelligence base so uh, step by step it's improving uh, chat gpt system and you can ask any questions here and you will get your answer so I hope uh, this video will be helpful for you and if you like my video then please subscribe to my YouTube channel and please don't forget to press on the bell icon so you will get all the updates related Golang programming and the backend programming things. So see you in the next lecture. Thank you very much.